A story you'll see only on Eyewitness News. A local firefighter is recognized for saving, her, saving someone's life. And tonight, only Eyewitness News was there when she was honored by her colleagues and the man who she helped save. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen joins us now live in our studio with a story that's new at 11. The Western Coventry Fire Station was packed tonight as family and friends came out to honor heroic efforts. Bob Verdecchia is alive today and in great spirits, but just a few weeks ago, that's something no one would have expected. Verdecchia went into cardiac arrest while working, and Desiree Fournier was on scene ready to save his life. From being on the department, I know statistically once somebody goes into cardiac, it's, it's very rare that they come out. Bob's heart stopped beating as Fournier pounded on his chest. And within probably maybe three minutes he began to breathe again. Bob says he woke up five days later in the hospital without knowing what had happened. I remember absolutely nothing. But when he heard the story... Oh, she, there's no words to express how thankful I am to her. Fournier received the EMS Pride Award for her efforts for saving Bob's life. It's something her friends, colleagues, and especially Verdecchia were happy to witness. But she said the best moment was when she got to come back home the night she saved a life. It was really nice to be able to come home to my husband and kids and let them know that, you know, that was a good day. Now, Fournier is very humble and was quick to say that it's her training that allowed this story to have a happy ending. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.